We're talking about discovering life on another planet. It'll change our concept of who we are, where we came from, and where we're going. In season three of For All Mankind, we're jumping almost 10 years into our history timeline. It's now the 90s, an era with a huge explosion of technology. We have bases on the moon. We have a hotel in orbit. The space race is booming, and you start to see space tourism. And the idea of reaching further into space is the main driving force in the race to Mars. The whole world waits to see who will land first. We're living in a world where getting to Mars is a possibility. And it's a race between the superpowers of NASA, the Soviets, and now a company called Helios. We will propel this one-of-a-kind spacecraft on an epic journey of exploration to Mars. Helios is a private company and truly wants to do something groundbreaking. You are going up against the two most powerful nations in the world. All of these different groups are going head to head to get to Mars first, and the politics of the Cold War are now much more complicated. Because of their commitment and dedication has spanned three decades, it takes an already high stakes situation and makes it even higher stakes. The US of A is gonna win this race. There's a sense that that competition brings everyone together. The future belongs to all of us. This can support large scale human colonization. This race to Mars is definitely just the tip of the iceberg. We will see them begin to establish a new colony, like the early settlers start a new Jamestown. And we see all the difficulties and challenges and the sacrifices it takes to get there. Our mission is to create a sustainable base and survive. Oh my God. And the idea of what we can do and where we can go from here to be explorers and things that make us better as human beings and do great things. That's what's gonna push mankind to make the next leap forward. Colonizing Mars and the moons of Saturn. What if this is our chance? Space truly is the final frontier. Human beings are always gonna wanna see what's over that next hill. It's only the beginning.